Hey everybody, it's Brian here. Eddie here. And uh, we're doing another Review the World Pit. Um, this one, you know, uh, months ago, the world, there was an outri outrage, there was an outcry. Uh, hostess closed up their doors. No more Twinkies, no more Snowballs, no more Susie Q's. All these, you know, things that we grew up with and stuffed our faces with, you know. We thought uh, it was the end of the world. We got childhood, you know, onset diabetes with. These were the things that we did. And the Hostess is gone. Um, in its wake, a lot of people are trying to come up and, and, and claim that throne and all the money too. Because I mean, that's a big, that's a big void at the uh, at the grocery store. At my grocery store, the host of stuff gone, empty pallet. In the recent weeks, a new brand has came in and they've came in with a bang. They're called Tasty Cake. Now, with Tasty Cake, a lot of variety. They do um, obviously cakes. They do pies. They do. Um, a, a, wide variety of, of, of pastries, baked goods, you know, uh, donuts, mini donuts. Um, I've got a couple of their items today. We're going to try them. We're going to see if they deserve to, to wear the crown. Uh, up first, from Tasty Cake, these are their candy bar cakes. Now, these take popular licensed brands like Reese's, which we have today, as well as your Peppermint Patty and Hershey's, and they, you know, they, they use a snack cake with the, uh, the candy bar. Um, so, Ed, um, what would your expectations be here? Well, are, are, are you expecting to be wowed? Kind of. And do you like Reese's in general? I think that's probably oh, yeah. a pertinent question. Okay. Yeah, peanut butter and chocolate together are great. Now the texture of this is, is actually kind of exciting. It looks quite good. Uh, it's a firm chocolate on the outside. Obviously it's very on the inside. We're going to crack it open. Very crisp, but actually broken too nicely. It looks like a nice kind of grainy, coarse texture with the peanut butter. I mean, uh, from looks alone, this looks really good. It and again, I'm not even a guy that's a big sweets guy, but I mean, this looks the part. What were you going to say? You think it looks... It's squishy like a brownie. It yeah. really is. It's, 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 it's like a home-baked brownie. Yeah, the inside, you're right. I mean, it, the, the ingredients all look... It let's go ahead and uh, let's just jump in. And... Mm-hmm. It's like a brownie. This is good. Like a brownie with peanut butter in the middle. I'm not a huge sweet guy, but it's I, I'm glad that we're breaking this in half because yeah, I, I feel you know better off just eating a half of this. I didn't check the, uh, the nutrition on the side. Um, how many calories are in one of these? Is that I guess say? over here, uh, serving size, uh, one cake. Oh, 280 calories. Wow. Fat so, calories, 140. 15 grams of fat, 23 grams of sugar, yeah. 15 gra uh, milligrams of cholesterol, 4 grams of protein, and 2 grams of fiber. I think the gimmick that about this particular thing is, that I like is that the, the chocolate is very crisp. It kind of breaks when you take a bite. The inside is very fluffy. Uh, the peanut butter. It's a, it's, these are good. Um, up next, we're going to try something that could be controversial. We'll see. Okay, uh, I think the first item was a success. The second item, I, I said it could be controversial, and that's w the reason why, Nick, is that Tasty Cake is taking aim directly at Hostess's biggest seller, or at least most beloved property, the Twinkie. And the this thing is, is what they call Dreamies. They're cream cakes. When Twinkies first actually went off the market, you know, people were trying so hard to actually fill that void. Boxes of Twinkies were going on sale on eBay for $10,000. You know, that is nuts. And any of you people out there with the internet connection, you know that's, that's you know, wild. It was it was crazy internet fodder. Something that we picked up on when we were back in the studios before we came out here into the, the brittle cold is that um, this is sponge cake and it's moist. There's actually moisture in the package, which that excites me because I do. Yeah. The last thing, if I'm going to eat you know, empty calories and eat snack foods, I at least want them to taste great and, and have nice texture. If it's dry and kind of uh, dried out, I would, I would probably just toss it in the can after one bite. In fact, most people I know who were, like, the last actual Twinkie brand I had, I remember wow. eating, it was dry and kind of Yeah, it's probably stale. been sitting on the shelf for a while. And So these look good. Nick, grab yours. And, uh... Wow. They do look like a dream come true. Yeah. It's really fresh. It is different though. They have uh, look wise, yeah. it's a Twinkie, but flavor wise, there's there is some different stuff happening. Yeah, I can't, I can't put my finger on it. I think and if the, I were to say the biggest element that I noticed of change in is the cream filling. Yeah, the cream is the definitely... cream. The cream in a, a Twinkie really doesn't have a flavor. It's a little sweet. This almost tastes like an ice cream to me. Yeah, almost yeah. a vanilla. 
like a like icing that you would put on your cake. Yeah, so very a uh, lot more flavor. Now the the cake itself, it is spongy, but it it's also kind of firm. Yeah. You know, it's 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 uh, it's it could be good. due to the cold, you know. Yeah. But yeah, I'm, I'd have to say tasty cake. I've sampled two of your products so far. At this point, I'm impressed. You could always take a misstep later down the road. I'm not a huge guy. You're going to buy a lot of these. But I figured we owed the audience out there in the world what's going to take Hostess's place. Yeah. And i got to say, from what I've experienced and what I've tasted, a Tasty Cake has probably taken the lead. It's definitely worth the purchase. You know, I know a lot of people out there, you know, they're afraid of taking that step. They're like, you know, they're, they're ding-dongs, you know, and their Suzy Qs are gone, and they don't know what to replace it with. Yeah, and I can say, yeah. the Tasty Cakes, uh, these would be pretty good pretty good replacement. Yeah, I definitely recommend, you know, pick one that you think interests you and try it and come to your own conclusions, but uh, take me out to the ball game. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Thanks for watching, baby. Review the world. Check back, Reg.